CA Endeavor Bridge for Git works with popular enterprise Git servers like GitHub, Bitbucket, and in this case, GitLab. Today, I'll demonstrate the experience from a Git developer's perspective and show how Endeavor can be used with GitLab's seamless CI-CD capabilities. Here we see a GitLab repository that's been initialized with application source code from CA Endeavor. Changes made to code in GitLab will be synchronized to a map to entry stage. Once in Endeavor, they can be built, tested, and promoted up the lifecycle. Teams can use GitLab CI-CD to drive Endeavor automation with Zoe CLI. This allows them to visualize processes and layer in source code scanning and other off-host automation. Here we see a simple GitLab CI YAML file. When a change triggers the pipeline, Zoe CLI is used to build the affected applications in Endeavor. Working in Visual Studio Code, we start by creating a feature branch just as we would for any distributed project. The COBOL files have been cloned into our working directory from GitLab. Using the File Explorer, we find and update the required source code files. As we edit the files, we can see the changes are being tracked by the Visual Studio Code Git plugin. After the changes are done, we stage them, and before committing them, we will do a build of our pending updates with Zoe CLI. This ensures our code compiles properly and allows us to test before we update GitLab. The return code indicates the build was successful, so we can go ahead and commit our changes. Committing only updates the local Git repo, so we must push our changes to GitLab to share them with our team. Here we see our new branch. To merge it with the master branch and perform the integration build, we create a GitLab merge request. No conflicts have been detected, so we click the merge button to integrate the code with the master branch. Changes to the master branch are automatically synchronized to the mapped CA Endeavor entry stage. A webhook fires, triggering the GitLab CI-CD pipeline script for the repository, which builds the updated elements using Zoe CLI. Without reinventing the build or other lifecycle automation, GitLab developers can make mainframe changes using familiar processes and add in off-host automation for an end-to-end, -end, fully automated CI-CD pipeline. 